very excited, very aware of the responsibilities. Her Majesty the Queen has asked me to form a new administration and I have accepted. It is of course the greatest honour that can come to any citizen in a democracy. I know full well the responsibilities that await me as I enter the door of number 10 and I'll strive unceasingly to try to fulfil the trust and confidence that the British people have placed in me and the things in which I believe. And I would just like to remember some words of St Francis of Assisi which I think are really just particularly apt at the moment. Where there is discord, may we bring harmony. Where there is error, may we bring truth. Where there is doubt, may we bring faith. And where there is despair, may we bring hope. And to all the British people, howsoever they voted, may I say this, now that the election is over, may we get together and strive to serve and strengthen the country of which we are so proud to be a part. Have you got any thoughts, Mrs Thatcher, at this moment about your Mrs Pankhurst and your own mentor in political life, your own father? Well, of course, I just owe almost everything to my own father. I really do. He brought me up um, to believe all the things that I do believe, and they're just the values on which I fought the election. And it's passionately interesting to me that the things which I learned in a small town, in a very modest home, are just the things which I believe have won the election. Gentlemen, you're very kind. Well, I mean,